Welcome to Resident Evil. I was going to do this intro once we actually got into the game, but it seems we have to choose who we want to play as. And I think we're going to go with Jill and we're going to be normal police stars people. Alpha team is flying around the forest zone situated in northwest Raccoon City, where we are searching for the helicopter of our compatriots, Bravo team, who disappeared during the middle of their mission. Is that where Resident Evil Zero comes in? Are they the Bizarre people we're looking for? Have recently occurred in Raccoon City. There are outlandish reports of families being attacked by a group of about ten people. Victims were apparently beaten. Mm -hmm. The Bravo team was sent in to investigate, but we lost contact. Look, Chris. Maybe it wasn't them. Okay. The Bravo team's helicopter was a derelict. Nothing. They just gone. Save for the remaining body of Kevin. Would Kevin not come back as a zombie? We continued huh. our search for the other members. And it turned into a nightmare. And how long has the other team been gone for as well, I wonder? Oh my god, I would hate just going through a forest. That doesn't sound good. D -d dog noises, wolf dog noises are never good. I wouldn't put my gun down, sir. See? You put your guard down. You die. Oh, God. Did they use all of their bullet? Oh, there's four dogs. Uh, but how is there not one dead dog? How many times did they shoot? Yeah, we might want to run. I think I think we run. Thank God. Come on. You can outrun dogs, right? Oh, again, I don't know if they're dogs or wolves. They look like dogs. Hey, Brad. Where Where he going? Why did they have the? Hello. Chris, this way. Yes, this way, Chris. Now, did they land the helicopter and then, I guess, take off again and decide to just leave these people behind? If we make it out of this alive, never trust Brad again. There are only three Stars members left now: Captain Wesker, Barry, and myself. How many were there to begin with? What is this place? Not quite your ordinary house, that's for sure. Hey, Wesker, well, no, where's it's a mansion. This? Jill, no. You don't want to go back out there. What well, if I do? Find... What was that? Chris? No. Jill, go and investigate. I'm going Why did she say no? Chris and I go back a long way. All right. You two go. I'll secure this area. Stay sharp. At least there's a group of us in this game, and it's not just us. But yeah, why did... They're like, maybe it's Chris. No! As if she knew it wasn't. Dining room. So we can save if we want, which I might hold off on I saving for now. What is it? Blood. Blood. I thought he was about to lick that. I'm going to be honest. Jill, see if you can find any other clues. I'll be examining this. Let's just hope it's not Chris's. 
Well, how much can you actually learn from this blood by just looking at it? I guess, do we want to go through any of these other doors? I mean, there's not many ways for us to go. This is the only door apart from if we go back out into the main area. And we have a long hallway, of course. What else would we have? I guess I should check back this way first, maybe. Hey, buddy. You having a nice snack? Don't tell me he's eating Chris. Or is Chris... Uh, 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 run back this way real quick. So now, aim down here. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, ten shots. That's, that's a lot. That, that's a lot of shots. Is there another one? Who is this? Corpse of Comrade Kenneth. It looks like he's holding something. It's a film that belonged to Kenneth. I need a video player to see what's reported on it. Okay. Now, why were we not worried about Kenneth at all? Why are we worried about... Um, Heath, or whatever his name actually was. Uh, better report back to Wesker. Okay, probably a good idea. Oh, it wasn't even dead. Well, at least I know it's dead now, because I got the achievement for killing my first zombie. But I guess let's go talk to Wesker. Let him know Kenneth is dead. Barry. What is it? Or Barry, I guess. Look out, it's a monster. Kill it, Barry! Let Kill me it! Take care of it! They take a lot of shots, Barry. Are you telling me he only needed to shoot three times? I needed to shoot what like ten. This thing? I, found I want your gun, Barry. Killed by this thing. Let's report this to Wesker. Okay, I guess we're put reporting to Wesker. I should also save while I'm at it. Now that I've actually killed a zombie. Okay, I guess let's go find. What? I I'm not going through there. I don't care. I heard a zombie. I'm not going to go towards the zombie noises or wherever the game is trying to push me to go. We're just going to go talk to Wesker. Because I'm also sort of very low on ammo. Jill, help me look for him. Let's not leave this hall. Good idea. I think that sounds fair. Also, I kind of want to see what happens if I try and go outside. Better finish. Okay, that, that's fair. I mean, did not, did, would Wesker not have gone through one of the doors around here? And does going down here count as the hole? Because it's not through, technically through a door. Never mind, it is through a door. Um, I guess he's upstairs then? Barry. Any luck, Jill? No, nothing. What's going on around here? I can't figure it out. Same here. It's zombies. And now Wesker. There's not much we can do. We can search for him separately. I'll investigate the dining room again. Okay, then. I'll try the door on the other side. <sighs> this mansion is gigantic. We could easily get lost. Let's start from the first floor. Okay. Oh, I almost forgot. It's a lock. What is it? Oh. You'd make better use of it. Thank you, sir. You got lockpick. Thanks. I may need it. Listen. If something happens, let's meet up in this hall. Got it? Okay. Sounds good to me. Well, he says something happens to meet up in this hall, but how, how is there a guarantee that he's going to be here if I come here? Or vice versa. I don't know. Anyway, uh, double door. Does it want to open? We can go through the double door and brings us to a thing. What is up in that pot? Woman drawing water. Where? What's in the pot there, though? How do we get what's in the pot? I'm feeling we might want to do a little bit of pushing. Now, can I reach this thing from here? I should be able to. There's a map of the mansion, first floor, take it. Yes, anything will help, honestly. 100% items. Now, does that just mean you don't need them anymore? Or what does that actually mean? I don't know. Anyway, we got the map. I guess let's see what's actually back here. Very long corridor and a dagger. I guess we'll take the dagger for something. And emergency evade. Use defensive items such as daggers will allow you to escape momentarily when grabbed by an enemy. However, you will not be able to escape when the enemy grabs you from behind. To equip a defensive item, go to the status screen and then select an item from the defensive item menu, then select equip command. If your defensive item mode is set to manual in the controller settings, you must press E to use a defensive item. Uh-huh. So I go N. Okay, seems we have it equipped. Are they going to have us maybe use that item, I'm going to assume. 
probably. That's probably what this is happening for. Why are they like... Now, if I let it grab me from in front, we have our defensive item, right? Yes, we do! Ha-ha! Now we run, and we, we never come back. Oh, God, it's locked. An emblem of a sword is carved into the lock. Okay. God, how many bullets do I have left? None! That's how many! Zero! Nada! All I have is my knife! Ready? I'll stab ya! Them actually getting me. Got him. Okay. I can hit him without them actually hitting me. It's just really... I don't like it. They have to get way too close to me. Is he dead? I don't trust that he's dead. There's no blood. There is blood. Does blood pools mean they're dead, though? I don't know. Okay, well, I can't stab them. I'm going to assume that they're dead. And we're going to leave. And they better not be awake when I come back. We've done everything in that room. I guess we can go through this room now. Never mind. It's locked. And it has an emblem of a helmet carved onto the lock. What about downstairs? Can we go through this? I think I've changed my mind. I wonder what's on the other side. I don't. I mean, I kind of do, but I don't know if I want to go to a sound of zombie moans and chain noises. And I don't think there's any other doors we can go through. So we're going to go out this one. Now, hopefully Bobby or Billy or whatever is still in here. They're not. I actually just remembered. What happens if I actually try and go out the front door? I haven't tested that out because I wasn't able to before. Oh, there's dogs out there. Close the... It's too dangerous. I was gonna, I was gonna try and open it again. I was intrigued if I could open it again and just see how many dogs I could possibly get in here. I might want to go back to my last save because this ain't, this ain't good. I can't deal with a dog while holding a, while using a knife. I was having my health looking. I'm gonna die. I'm dead. Dogs, very dangerous. Noted. Hey, got an achievement. Die for the first time. Get used to it. Oh, don't you worry, game. I'll get used to dying. You don't have to worry about that. Well, note to future self. Don't open the front door or try and go outside. Because dogs will, will attack. I was going to say mo will most likely attack you, but will attack you. Now, what do we got up here? We take the emblem. Yes. From the status screen, select an item and then select the examine command. The details of the item will be displayed. Uh-huh. Huh, so go over to here, and then examine, and then you can check. It's gold all around the edges due to frequent fitting. You know where that probably goes to? I would say that goes through the door where it had a emblem, right? Also, is the zombie dead? Zombie's still on the ground. No blood, though. Still can't stab it. I've got to assume it's dead. Now, did it, was this the one that had the shield emblem on it? It's locked. An emblem of a sword. No, that's a sword. Oh, I haven't found the shield one, have I? Because the one in the main room was a helmet, right? An emblem of a... Okay, yeah, that... So that one is the helmet. So I guess we have to actually find where the shield one is. Which I'm not going to go upstairs yet. I'm going to take the great advice from that dude. And just stay on the first floor. Which actually... The door that we went to the first time... That might have been the one that needed a shield for it. I also really don't want to run into another zombie. Because that means i'm gonna have to do take them out purely by knife now is this the one no this is oh right no we couldn't go through here because we had to report to wesker that's right hello anybody home anybody perhaps want to try and murder me i'm hoping not Finally, some ammo. Thank God. I will definitely take that. This is my safety blanket. Also, please equip. I don't trust that at all. Now, we do have some herbs here, which I'm not going to use yet. But I don't actually know if you can combine herbs in this game. I guess I can check if I can combine herbs in this game. Actually, I just noticed we also have more... Oh my God, this is so good. Which, because I started from zero and we're going all the way up to whatever it's up to now. And it feels so good to have, like, eight spots of inventory. I also didn't mean to do that. I want to combine with this one. There we go. I mean, I guess in the other one, we technically had more because we had two sets of six. But it just feels good to have this character to at least have a little more story. Now, what do we got through here? Actually, I just noticed we went upstairs, didn't we? I just said I wasn't. But here we are going up steps. 
another zombie on the floor that might not be dead might just be faking it we have a mirror and a zombibble in here get him surely back shots do more yes okay that was only four shots but it's not it's not dead is it dead now i think when they bleed it means they're actually dead what do i have to do to kill these things it's not dead now it's dead it's not dead i think i know what i gotta do i think we shoot them to make them fall down then we equip the knife and then we stab them when they're on the ground but i think it's actually dead yeah it is actually dead now there is blood on the ground so we know it's dead i think that's the strategy we have to be going for because otherwise i'm gonna run out of ammo i know it's not dead so we i'm actually out of thing anyway so we come here we equip the knife and we stab them stab them while they're down oh god oh no flex spare me quick 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 get a few stabs get a few stabs now quickly grab the ammo grab the ammo grab the ammo i'm not used to using f while he's on the ground stab okay I know it's actually dead as well, because if you can, if you can't stab them on the ground, they're dead. Now, what do we got here? We take the golden arrow, sure. Now we have two doors: this door or this door. This door looks like one of the confession booths, so you'd have it like a church. So let's go through this one. This is upstairs. I'm going back through. I don't want to come back down out to the main area yet. Also, how are we looking on health? Portion not particularly great i'm thinking maybe i should just use the one plant that we had out in the area back here just to get myself back up to an okay amount of health because i'm pretty sure if we use this we should get back up to yellow caution maybe i should have used the green the other green thing but is this one dead i don't trust this it is dead for now but it's one of those things where this game doesn't let you attack enemies some enemies that are already there until it's time for the sequence to actually happen where they get up and start attacking you. Now, can we go through here? It's locked from the other side. Or doggy. Well, I guess we can check out this door. Never mind. This door is locked from the other side too. So, what about this door? Okay, this door actually does open. I wonder if this goes to the one that was said it was locked from the other side. Because it does get closer to there. There's an inscription on the shield. Death is only the beginning. Well, what's after death then? What about this one? There's an inscription on the shield. Death is the true essence of bliss. May whoever takes this emblem find peace in death. Will you take the mansion key? Yes. Oh. Ah. 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 I can't do anything. I can't do anything. I can't do anything. Oh. Oh, that's a. Ah. 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 Uh, and, uh, use, put it back. We're all good. Nothing to worry about. Wait, so the thing here moved back is... Oh. Okay, is... It's locked. An emblem of a helmet. Okay. So we have two helmet doors and a sword door. I haven't found the shield door yet, though. Okay, but what I'm learning is don't take this key until we have some way of... It's, I was going to say weighing it down, but it's more, I guess, weighing it up. I don't know. Something like that. Or maybe I could have grabbed it because it said death is bliss. And death is only the beginning. So maybe I, it would have stopped or something. I don't know. Either way, we've explored everything off this way for now. But there is still so much to explore. Also, I really hope Kenneth doesn't come back as a zombie. I feel like there might, but I don't know. I don't know. Anyways, can we go through this door? Locked from the other side. Who's locking all these doors? What about this one? Also locked. An emblem of an armor is cut. Okay. When are we going to get one for a shield? Surely soon. Now, this is an elevator. It doesn't look like you can access it from this floor. You probably need to, yeah, I guess, use one of the other floors to be able to start using the elevator. It's locked. An emblem of a sword. My God, what is it with them? all of these doors needing swords? Well, I guess we can just go back to the main mansion area and then start heading upstairs and see what doors we can actually go through. Come up here, look at the beautiful painting. Or look at... Oh. Or a secret door. I, I, I guess that works too. God, this thing does not want to fall down, does it? Oh! Well, it's definitely dead now. Okay, there is another one. 
I don't know where that zombie is though. All I can do is hear it. At least I know that zombie over there is dead. Can we go through here? It's locked from the other side. Of course it is. Everything's locked from other sides. But, you know, I'm honestly impressed that I that I found that. I mean, sure, finding the door was a bit of an accident, but I still found it. And I'm going to take that as a win. Also, please don't be facing that way. I need to be able to see the zombie. I also don't like how I don't have that much of an open area. So I'm not going to be able to do much of the stabbing. Now, hit and run. Did you just try and vomit on me? No, get off of me. Get off. Get off. I'm going to stab them while they're down. Oh. Let's go. He's down. Okay, now. Danger. So that's why we're going to use this. And bring us all the way back up to caution. Which is still not great. But better than nothing. Now, what was this thing protecting? Ammo. For... Shotgun! Yes! Now, we have ammo for the shotgun. I just don't really have a shotgun, and I feel like we can't throw shotgun shells fast enough to be able to do any damage. So, might be a little bit of a problem. Uh, tomb engraved with a picture of an angel. There is an indentation in the shape of an arrowhead. We have an arrow, don't we? Yes, we do. So, use... It won't fit in the indent indentation as it is. I guess that's everything out here. I've lost all of my ammo. And all of my healing. But at least we've secured this area out here. Actually, I guess, to be fair, that does kind of look like a door. Now that I look at it. But I definitely wouldn't have looked at that as a door before. Now, I'm sick. That's just thunder. We're all good. I was about to say lightning, but... No, thunder. It's locked. An emblem of a... God, why is it always an emblem of a sword or armor or a helmet? Why can I not just get an emblem of a shield? Locked from the other side. What about the double door? The double door opens at least. Also, where has Billy gone? I have gone through like all of the doors I can and I have not seen Billy at all. What is this? I don't like this at all. And as long as they're stuck on this thing, I should be able to hit them, right? Okay, they unstuck themselves. They unstuck themselves. I don't like how little damage this thing does, this knife. It's like I have a little butter knife and I'm saying, Hey, take this. I'll spread butter on your belly. Oh, yes. Actually, this thing. Take it. I will definitely take the dagger. Go to my inventory. Okay, it is equipped now. I'm so glad they automatically equip. I was going to say hit and run, but I guess it didn't quite work. Yes, hit them while, while they're down. Hit and run. Okay, they're down again. Are they dead? They're dead. Let's go! Only because I've also lost my defensive weapon thing now, but that's that's fine. There's another zombie down. Every zombie down, I take as a win. And this takes us back to this room. So, is this above the dining room? I think this is above the dining room. Then this one's locked. An emblem of a sword. Of course, it's a sword. Why would it be anything else? Stained glass window. The pattern in the center resembles a woman. Uh-huh. I'll try and remember that. Why is there a gap here where there's no railing? I'm assuming there's a reason for that. I can push this. I can't look at it. Okay. Well, I have a guess what I got to do. We push this down just where there's no railing. And I'm guessing we can grab the gem that it's holding. And I've also tried every single door in this upstairs area now. So unless this thing that I dropped... Gives me a way of finding or opening some new doors. I don't know where I'm going. I think I've also taken out all the zombies so far. Will you take the blue gemstone? What will I use a blue gemstone for? I should also probably think about saving. Downstairs. The thing downstairs. It said I wonder what's on the other side. But we never actually tried opening it, did we? There's an octagonal indentation to the right and left of the door. Okay, we need something. Wait, would this work? It's not necessary to use this now. You notice, notice what happened to the bird here? Because there's feathers in here. A large bird cage. There's a dead ray. Oh, there's a bird inside. What? I didn't see a bird inside. Let me see this bird. Yeah, I don't see a bird. I'm going to be honest. But there's a lot of feathers in there. So, I guess it checks out. What if I try putting this back? Don't think that changed. Never mind. That was again just thunder. I thought I heard something moving. I don't think that's changed anything. So, I guess I'll just take the emblem back for now. I think I might leave it here because my brain is thoroughly confused. I also don't want this video being too long because I know that was a long intro. But, um, yeah, I guess I hope you did enjoy this video. If you did, please think about liking and subscribing. It really does help me out. 
And I guess if anyone has maybe some ideas for what to do with what we have at the moment, or maybe what we could try, do let me know down in the comments. And uh, yeah, I hope to see you in the next one. See ya.